and even as the president of the company, I will not join this. He said, you are, you have abundance of water, so pani ki kadar nahi aapko. Kya toh waha pe, they have uh, shundar hai, aur shundar ka jo khara pani hai, usse toh chara pahla nahi hoga. So he said, okay, first we have to purify that uh, sea water, so that it becomes uh, for raising uh, water crops. So we have worked out that to produce one liter of milk, 600 liter water is consumed for fossil uh, fuel water and then animal will drink water and uh, you have to uh, wash the cattle and everything. So they have worked out 600 liters of water is required. Uh, mineral water, supreme water, uh, in Pashwa Hotel, Tata, uh, Tata is producing in, uh, in selling, uh, Water is 55 rupees in the MRP on that. You had asked for it, you are to pay maybe 80 rupees or so. And Tata has not manufactured that water. So what they have done, uh, it's a natural spring water that comes out that it is not polluted with any, there's no, uh, it, it's pure mineral water. It contains minerals and it contains micro, uh, organism called uh, in, uh, forgetting the name uh, and that uh, is anti-bacterial uh, so it has a long shelf life that is why Ganga Dal remains good if it is taken from Kumbu 3 for even 10 years it will remain good for it so if water is selling in India at 55 rupees a liter then if you multiply 55 with 600 what will be the price of milk? What should be the price of milk? Danya, so it's a, it's a good opportunity for you. So today, 3300. So Danya is going to do the sales talk. When she is marketing milk, she is going to tell her consumers that I am going to give you pure milk and at a price which is cheaper than or at the same price but uh, Tata is selling uh, spring water. So that means if he can sell milk at even at 55 rupees and she purchases that milk, say she pays uh, 40 rupees, that is what the milk trade is uh, paying today for buffalo milk. Their price is uh, 40 rupees. So if, if he purchases from milk producer, at, at the rate of 40 rupees and sells at the price of water, mineral water, 55 rupees, then what is the opportunity? 15, 15 rupees. And out of 15 rupees, I am, uh, Mr. Aroda will tell you that uh, all energy is coming from sun. And solar energy and pasteurization is only heating and cooling. It's not a rocket science. Is it a rocket science? It is only simply heating the milk to a certain temperature and then cooling it down to a certain temperature and cooling it away. That's all. So if we use solar energy or biogas and pasteurize milk, we purchase milk at 40 rupees, pasteurize that milk using solar energy. Have anybody received milk from the sun? But we receive uh, regularly see water bill, electricity bill from municipal corporation and we have to pay otherwise our connection is disconnected. And uh, so if we tap the energy free of cost and we uh, teach uh, Tanya how to pasteurize the milk in a bottle which speaks for itself, right? And we teach her how to sterilize the milk using solar energy and produces milk and she says she is going to, uh, she wants only 5 rupees, she wants only 5 rupees per liter but the margin is more than 15 rupees. So if she wants to uh, help the consumer to get pure milk so she can give 3 rupees lower than the anybody selling milk. So consumer gets 3 rupees less at, at a lesser rate and producer gets 3 rupees more. So what will happen? You will be left
left with? You will be left with nine rupees. And if the this is a bottle, which is which can be recycled. What is the cost of packing material cost? The bottle. If you have a glass tumbler in your house where you drink water or you drink milk, what do you do? You drink and throw that. So you wash that. So if we are using uh, packing material is used, uh, this glass bottle is used as packing material. That means we can uh, clean it and reuse it. And if you are using it for domestic consumption, what is going to be the packing cost? It is going to be zero. Because what is the, this is a beer cap. It's called beer cap. It's airtight. So if you uh, uh, put milk in this bottle and heat this bottle, to the temperature, home pasteurization is uh, a batch process where you don't have to heat the milk to 72 degrees Celsius. If you heat the milk to, note down, if you heat the milk to 62 degrees Celsius and hold that milk at that temperature for more than 30 minutes, then all the pathogens are destroyed. So when pathogens are destroyed uh, by batch process home pasteurization and if you are using solar energy, uh, there is no uh, uh, cost of heating the milk and you can now in Chandigarh, Chandigarh has been declared as solar city. You know how many of you know Chandigarh has been declared as solar city and now it is compulsory if you have a house more than 10 marwa, you will have to install uh, solar panels and uh, generate your electricity. That means uh, the, it is the initial cost, but when you generate electricity and uh, uh, you use the heating uh, system with the solar and then uh, generate electricity and use the refrigerator, so what will be your processing cost, Tanya? There is no, there is no bill for uh, cooling the milk, there is no bill for heating the milk. So that means, if she is purchasing the milk, whatever age she is purchasing from a person who is producing the milk, 100 liters, so he, using this uh, system, she can pasteurize the milk uh, with no processing cost, with no packing cost. So, Hunta Tadita Vajadu. It's so easy and uh, he has never been to any home science college or dairy college. I, I, I have studied in uh, Karnal. I know how hard it is to uh, face the examination. Huh? You would know that. But uh, he, he learned it from me in just 10 days. And he has, now this milk is produced by him, not by me. And it's home pasteurized milk and it will stay good in your fridge for 15 days. <laughs> so we are uh, uh, going uh, steady with uh, Tanya to be a business person and uh, so God bless you. Run, run the show. So uh, uh, he is going to teach you. Uh, she will, uh, he will demonstrate uh, and she will learn from us, both of us. Not Uncle Google, Uncle, uh, I'm a milky uncle. Um, uh, I'm known in my uh, neighborhood as Milky Uncle. <laughs> <laughs> so there is a story behind it. Why I am called Milky Uncle? I had a pet. I had a Mary Uncle. And I named because I was in milk business. So I named him Milky. <laughs> <laughs> so all the children in the state know as a Milky Uncle. So I'm a Milky Uncle, right? So he is going to learn from Milky Uncle and uh, Ashoka. And uh, once he learns how to pasteurize the milk at home and it stays good for uh, uh, 15 days or 10 days, uh, so she, she is going to convert that into business opportunity. So everybody is understood who can say that Ham Sik Jayenge, Tanya Ko Ham Sikha Denge, Tanya Aapko Sikha Denge, So Aap Nahi Karna Chayenge. 
So that means we are we have told you in a summary form because I cannot teach what I learned in 50 years. I cannot uh, tell you in 50 minutes. But whatever I am telling, I am not only uh, giving you information. Why are you here in Home Science College? The books are now available on net. You can ask Google Uncle any questions theoretically. It is available. Information is available. Why you need teachers here? Why you need to join and spend four years here? No, no disturbance, no, no noise. Please be attentive. If you like this, you have to read the books, convert that information into knowledge with the help of your teachers. And when you are in the laboratory, like today Mr. Nata had a session with you. He taught you, you have read everything, how to make uh, sauce or how to make chutney or uh, things like that. But he practically demonstrated how you can do it, right? So that person is a, he has converted information into knowledge and knowledge into expertise. So if you, if you convert that into your expertise, then you can create business, manage business and are as much as you want. Right? That is what I'm saying. I'm teaching. He 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 he's working on that. He can make very good candy. Amla candy. He can make so many adar chutney, everything. But he taught. He, he knows already. And uh, when he uh, going to start his own company, uh, when you retired, what was your place? Yeah. Huh? Well, so when he retired, he was getting all that rupees. He was a senior manager in a syndicate bank. Right. So now. After retirement, uh, what I see in him, if he said starts uh, his this business where he can maximize because he has already demonstrated and I teach him to make this milk also. Here is good enough a period. If they are uh, finding it difficult to produce milk because they need 600 water, uh, sea water to be purified and uh, converted into fodder crops and they produce, it is very expensive for them. So uh, I made a presentation to Prime Minister of India that if uh, uh, you people sitting here in Home Science College, if you learn this technique, we are going to export uh, cow milk at the price of uh, diesel and buffalo milk at the price of petrol to our country. Do you have an export company? They will, they will all process the milk, travel and give it to you, you simply export it. <laughs> and earn as much as you want, right? So, uh, anybody who doesn't agree with me, so uh, not raise your hand, but stand up if you agree. Those who agree that it is, whatever I'm telling you, uh, it is possible, then you can uh, not raise your hand, but you can stand up for a while. So, this is standing ovation she deserves because she is the she is the first to take the initiative. That that initiative is very very important because if you uh, just venture <coughs> that I can do it, there is a ninety percent chance of you doing it. And if you give up and you are looking somebody else to do it and you will copy, then you are copying. Uh, uh, my grand chat. Uh, Grandchildren. So he is in Florida. He came here. They, oh, oh, my father was so happy. He was very happy. My parents were also. They, oh, oh, my no, my parents were also. I was thinking, I was thinking, my grandma was here. Why? They were doing this to make money. They, this day, my grandma was here. I was thinking, 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 I was thinking. And this is a, a sense of blessing. But since Ego India Junta, Tone Uda Jaw, Unisi Deta Jone Deta, Une Kodaki Jaw Deta, Kanda, if that happens, to see Minister Theatre Kat, or did all in Mirgo, then you will become dumb. <laughs> <laughs> this, is a, this is the American child. The person uh, who is uh, getting education in uh, America, so he is answering that. He gave me that answer and I was uh, stuck.
any doubt in particular, it's good uh, because then the person can uh, object to uh, if, if you should do because they say uh, I did a sting operation on him. This uh, this is a person uh, sitting in a mala selling 400 liters milk to these people who are coming to buy milk from him, and uh, it is available on uh, my LinkedIn. Uh, so I'll give you contact in relation to that. But what he is uh, uh, saying. He is selling milk, everybody comes is selling milk and I asked him uh, to just take up. I told him that he is two days now to start up a pair. He said, I have two days of water. He said, I have two days of water. He said, I have two days of water. So I made him uh, take a drink and then uh, he said, I have two days of water. But actually we have done our, I am a mission director of international mission. We did uh, survey here in Tri-City. Here, whatever milk uh, is available uh, through vendors, it contains 20 to 30 percent water, added water. So that water, 20 years ago, when I, uh, we are here for last many years, uh, we came to Chandigarh in 58, we used to drink tap water. But now tap water, even echo world is not working and we have to shift to RO. RO. So that means water available in India or even in Punjab or adjoining Chandigarh is not fit for human consumption. And if 20-30% what added water is coming uh, through these uh, milk vendors to you, so what are you taking in your food as milk? So it's harmful. And uh, as per survey conducted by PGA, Chandigarh has been declared as cancer prone city. It's not my statement. And because here, keeping cows or buffalo in your house is not allowed, so milk has to come from surrounding area. And if it does not contain any adulteration except added water, that itself is very harmful, very dangerous. Because you know, uh, from Punjab or Bhatinda area, there is a cancer train. They say the water there is unfit for human consumption. So if people are drinking their water, they are becoming sick. So it's just off the record I'm talking. Uh, so this what I've shown this video is that adulterated food is very dangerous and as home science uh, students you have to spread this message how important it is for you to take care of your health because your food you eat and uh, whatever you drink is going to be what you are. Now, can you guess my age? I ask your principal and uh, the teacher. No, you know, uh, can you guess what is my age? 71. No, I'm 27 years old. <laughs> no, again? No, I'm, I don't tell lies. I don't, I don't believe uh, telling lies. I've just only, you know, you are taking RO water. I have reversed my figures RO. I am 72 and I say I am 20. But if you say you want to test, I, I take one liter of milk which uh, is produced by 600 liters water. So that tonic keeps me going at 72. I am, uh, if when I am on the lake, I can walk as fast as even a 26 year old can't do that. So that means some, some of you were not saying uh, milk uh, is not a perfect. I say, you see me, milk is perfect food because I consume one liter of milk every day. Sir, is it safe to consume packaged milk like with a Verka milk package? Uh, no, I have been working with Verka. I started my career with a, with, as a dairy engineer with Verka and I was a managing director of Ludhiana Milk Plant for six years. And one year I was the MD for Milk Fed uh, Plant uh, Mahali. Now they are doing their best in the, under the given circumstances. They are trying to purchase uh, pure cow milk, pure buffalo milk. But unfortunately, the system of purchasing milk in India is faulty. And when uh, buffalo milk is mixed with uh, cow milk and some added water is also added in that, then not milk is not harmful, but that water which is uh, used for dilution is harmful. And for that, uh, nobody in India has a solution for the time being. But otherwise, uh, 
out of what is, if you compare that milk uh, with uh, vendor milk, it is certainly uh, it's much better, right? But then uh, gradually, uh, now in Canada, uh, your friend is uh, in Brampton. You ask, you ask her that if I go to Shopper Mall and purchase milk, there will be no painting on the porch. There will be no painting on the porch. That that will be a food grade uh, polythene, much thicker than this. And there is the outer bag. Uh, each uh, outer bag will be demonstrating which company and what is the fat content. All what is printed on this is not allowed. And three packets or one liter, there is an outer bag which will tell which company is producing this. All what is here will be on the outer bag. Now, please apply your mind that why Canada is not following us. Like uh, they made some all colorful things on that. Tanya, can you tell me? Probably this could be the reason that uh, proper intake, like if the person buys the food bag, so that is to be consumed within a certain period. No, no, I'm talking printing. I'm talking only printing on the book. <coughs> Probably some might even This take printing, away. this printing ink yeah, is poison. It's, it's a chemical. And polythylene is chemical, and this uh, printing ink is. And if it percolates down into the pouch, you can imagine. And if you want to try, do this experiment. Take any pouch of any company and put it in freezer cabinet for 10 days. It will become ice. And after 10 days, take out this pouch and put it in at room temperature. So this. Uh, the outer layer will melt first because it is uh, exposed to outside temperature. So when, say, 50 grams of milk becomes liquid form and it has come...